The other night, I was warming up and getting heavy between the sheets. Yet I had no men in my bed, or rather, in my hand. You see, I was using that secret love language no one was talking about having sex. There's a man I don't see often, and it can be hard to keep the spark alive. That's why we keep the momentum going by being extra creative with the texts. Whether it's explain exactly what we're going to do next time, we see each other, or send a visual aid, it's really an underrated form of expression. The right sex can elevate any sullen day's mood. It's right there with a perfect cup of coffee and a hassle-free, rush hour free ride to work. It just gives you a good start to the day. You send man a message as soon as he wakes up and has walking around with big smile on his face for the rest of the day. The real sweet spot is to send him one when he's in the middle of a busy meeting at work or his usual boring day. Send one when least expects it. Send him something tells exactly what he can look forward to when gets home that night and he'll be racing highway to you home. And who wouldn't want that? In fact, it might even be the perfect remedy for a fight. I had an argument with a guy recently that really turned his apple cart upside down. I was inattentive to his feelings, and that friendship surrounded me very quickly. So I got creative for his birthday. It wasn't much of an exaggeration, but I sent him a slightly arrogant birthday message. And again, didn't you know we're as good as gold? I believe this is because we all want to feel attractive at the end of the day. We want to know that there is someone who wants to have sex with us. It's kind of shallow, but hey, we're all living, breathing people. Nothing gets the heart rate up like a healthy dose of mutual lust. But it actually goes deeper than that. Sexting allows us to openly talk to each other about our sexual desires in a low-pressure environment. Not sitting across from each other, seriously, here's what I need in a sexual relationship, what do you need? You very transactional. No, it does it in a sexy way that depopulates and removes the anxiety of a difficult subject. Because God knows, sex discussions are never easy. Jana says sexting is a good excuse to talk about what you want in bed. Instead of seriously telling your partner that they need more foreplay to reach orgasm, text them like, I really like that you take the time to blow me up. Just thinking about it warms me up. Guess who will spend an hour in the South later that night? Also, having sex can open your horizons to try new things in the bedroom. If you're in a long-term relationship, you'll know that XX life can get boring, and I dare say, vanilla. You're tired, a little horny, so you're just going through the motions. Missionary with snoring side. Send your partner a bit of an extreme text like I think we should try insert sex position here tonight and feel try a little harder. Who says sex has to?